hello friends sir. welcome back to the channel today we are going to talk about something very serious if you are planning to start your career in IT or if you are already working as a DevOps engineer you might have heard a rumor people are saying DevOps is dead people are saying uh, AI will write the code AI will manage the server so why do companies need humans it is a scary thought right but friends today I am here to tell the truth the reality of uh, Indian market for 2026 so in this video we'll cover three main things the market reality the cloud battle and which cloud will provide more salary especially for Indian in 2026 first uh, let's talk about the job market is DevOps dead the short answer is no but the style of the DevOps you know is dying from 2022 2023 or 24 if you knew how to write a simple Jenkins pipeline or a small shell script, you are a hero as a DevOps engineer. You would get job easily. But in 2026, that is not enough because tools have become smart. The companies in India, especially the big companies like TCS, Infosys, Cipro, and HCL are moving towards something called platform engineering. What does this mean? Imagine you are a developer. In the old days, you would ask a DevOps engineer, hey, please create a server for me. The DevOps guy would spend two hours in creating. In 2026, companies want a self-service portal. The developer clicks one button and the AI or the platform builds the server automatically. The calls in 2026 are not for the people who can click the buttons. The calls are for people who can build the button. So who can have more calls as a DevOps engineer in 2026, you know, who are having a strong Kubernetes experience, not just knowing commands, but knowing how to secure it. And also who are good at DevSecOps. Security is the biggest worry for banks and fintech companies. So without DevSecOps, you won't be get any calls in 2026. And third one is AI integration. Companies want you to use AI tools to fix bugs automatically. Then what about uh, DevOps calls in 2026? The calls are there. In fact, NASCAM and other reports suggest that cloud and DevOps ops in India will grow by 20 to 30 percent uh, by 2026. But the entry questions will change. They won't ask you how to install Git. They will ask how do you automate security scans in a pipeline using a this kind of uh, this kind of entry questions you can expect in 2026 now the most requested topic is which cloud should i learn aws or azure so globally amazon uh, is the king it has about 30 to 40 percent of the market but in india the story is little different depending on where you want to work so most of the service based companies in india they are preferring azure only why because their clients are big fortune 500 companies like uh, uh, banks insurance companies healthcare education government these clients have been using microsoft windows outlook and excel for 20 years for them moving to microsoft azure is very easy so so that is the main reason azure devops is the golden ticket in 2026 in the upcoming years especially in indian location and one more scenario like uh, startup companies product based companies unicorn companies like Zomato, swiggy or us based product companies aws is the winner so my suggestion is if you are a fresher or uh, if you have career uh, gap then learn aws it is the standard if you know aws you can learn azure in three to four weeks only the learning resource for aws are more for experienced .NET professionals and uh, Windows based uh, who are working professionals, learn Azure. It matches your profile perfectly. Now, what about the DevOps engineer salary? You know, for uh, 0 to 2 years experience professionals, the average salary 4 to 6 lakhs per annum. Or some companies will provide 8 lakhs as well. Okay, for uh, 3 to 6 years ex experience candidate, you will get around 8 lakhs to 15 lakhs per annum. Now, if you have above 7 plus years of experience, then your salary range between 30 lakhs to 60 lakhs per annum. But you should have AI integration, artificial intelligence related skills. Now, everyone have doubts how you get these jobs. Don't just learn the old DevOps syllabus. Here is your uh, checklist for 2026. First, focus on learning Python or Golang. You cannot skip coding anymore. 
you need to write scripts to automate things and second skill is linux you have to master in it because 80 percent of the cloud runs on linux and third one pick one uh, cloud service either aws or azure don't try to learn both at the same time and next one is containerization docker and kubernetes kubernetes is mandatory without kubernetes there is no job and next skills are infrastructure as a code terraform terraform skills works both for aws and azure and next one is cscd github action or azure devops jenkins is still there but github action is the modern favorite uh, skills nowadays and uh, finally ea tools you have to learn how to use chart gpt or learn how to deploy llm apps as well if you put llm oaps on your resume you will stand out immediately so friends the conclusion is simple devops is not dying it is maturing the market in 2026 will filter out the people who can who only uh, memorize entry questions. Uh, you will definitely get a job if you understand the logic so the cloud market in india is just getting started okay so they need smart people like you so pick a cloud learn linux and start building projects don't just watch tutorial do the labs do the practice so that's all guys mine if you found this video is helpful please hit the like button and it helps the youtube algorithm show this to more students and also comment below team aws or team azure let's see who wins in the comments see you in the next video keep learning keep growing jai hind